Hello friends, welcome to Tutorials Point. In this video, we will run the store procedure that we had created in the earlier video. So running a store procedure is very simple to running a table valid function in the sense that you basically execute the store procedure by creating another job and allocating a use and when executing the store procedure you also pass in a parameter that would specify what is the data set that you want to touch upon. So we will look at a demo. Go to your uSQL catalog and within procedures you will find the store procedure that you had created earlier and just say run procedure and before submitting the job just remember that we need to pass in a parameter which is the file parameter of the input data so within the brackets let me paste this uh, text that I have created so basically I am saying that only refer to data set which is present within the vendor folder and the data set is 2008 February so put that within double brackets okay or rather I should say double quotes and go and submit the job after the job is successful go to your data tab and within data go into your outputs and just select the sales by month and in fact sales by month is not a file that you can go and select and view the data so sales by month is basically your table so let me go into that table now so the data is available within this table called sales by month so to look at the data you need to go and submit another uh, job you so you need to write another query table and basically if you write this query you will be able to see the data that we had uh, appended to the table now so I am not doing it right now because we have actually queried the table so if you want you can go ahead and do that just query the table and you will see the latest data that is available over there thank you